Hello and welcome. My name is Tyrion Lannister. Well, folks, it is a really exciting time in Game of Thrones winter is coming because we have our fourth anniversary. I truly cannot believe that we're already at this point, but it has been four years of playing this game. So if you click on go right here, so you got to click on the anniversary festival screen and then you go to this, click on go, it'll take you here. So um, we have the fourth anniversary party. First, there's a thank you letter where they explain that uh, it's the fourth anniversary, is right around the corner, we're proud to be one of the most popular strategy browser games worldwide, and thanks to our lords who have supported us over the past four years. Make sure you update the game in time, don't miss the various anniversary related events. So they go through the rules here, basically like a lot of these events, you just check in each day for 10 days, you get 5,000 diamonds, 30 honor banners, uh, two days of universal speed ups, 300 refinement, uh, five 50% boots, five elite badges, five gold friendship badges, friendship chests, 200 blessing stones. Um, I believe this is a like lord experience increase. Um, maybe it's a transnational relocation actually, hold on. Yeah, it's a transnational relocation, I apologize. No, that's way better. Transnational relocations are great. And then a legendary badge chest where you get a random gold badge, which is definitely always exciting to see what you get. Okay, what I wanted to show here is my year in review. Um, this is a special one. Um, I already had opened it before, but I'll show you guys. It's a cute little thing. Um, what I actually really thought was cool is that they actually tell me um, how long I've been playing, uh, which is wild to me, but I've been playing uh, since March 8th of 2019, which is uh, pretty crazy um, when I when I think about it that way, that it's been, been that long. Um, that I've been playing this one game, but um, they have a little bit of a review for you, what, you know, how many battles you've done, how many times you've helped allies, your dragon power, your number of troops, which, by the way, this number is, is insane. The fact that I have 85 million troops that I've trained over this time um, is, feels pretty insane uh, to me. I mean, I'm, I've definitely never been one to, to shy away from using my troops, but to think that I've trained 85 million sounds pretty insane. Um, they show elimination points, how many awakened commanders you have, your total individual merit, which my number is pretty low here. I'm pretty, I've always been disappointed. I just don't love merit hunting, which is ironic because they gave me the title of merit hunter, but I think that that's pretty low for someone with, uh, with my other stats. But um, yeah, I just think this is cute. It shows kind of a, a recap of what you've done over this entire time, and it's fun to be able to look back on that and see just how much you've done. Um, so I really enjoyed getting to to look at this and find out what title I was going to be given. So I got I got the Merit Hunter one. Um, other than that, uh, there's also these limited gifts that you can get, um, the Gulltown Valley and then an Avatar frame. And this is basically anyone that started playing this year. So I'll quickly jump back and I'll show what the Gulltown Valley gives. Um, so if we go to our Customize, it's right here. So as you can see, it gives 5,000 hospital capacity, and it also gives 5% enemy total attack reduction, but if you level it up, you can get up to 7.5%. So that's, I mean, right there, getting 7.5% enemy total attack reduction is definitely good. I mean, that's probably nice for everyone. And then they give gold dragon production, total health, and total defense. Um, when you level it all the way up, you're really just getting more gold dragon production. It starts at 10, then it goes all the way up to 20. So definitely nothing too crazy here. Um, I don't think anyone's going to be using this castle as their primary, uh, you know, uh, offensive castle, but I think that the, the collection bonus is definitely nice. It's good to get some, some more total attack reduction. And, you know, it's a, just a free thing that everyone's getting, so no complaints there. Um, but that's it for this one, folks. I think that the fourth anniversary event is definitely a fun one. Um, I, again, can't believe the game is this old, but I uh, definitely encourage you to take a look at it Take a look at your, your little note, your year in review, um, and I, I hope that everyone's excited. They also did these upcoming events I'll mention really quickly, um, specifically that the Night King invasion is coming back. Uh, the rest of it is you know, nothing else too crazy as we have Siege of Winterfell going on right now. Um, so definitely looking forward to the Night King invasion. Glad I got to read over my notes. And until next time, my name is Tyrion Lannister. I'll see you then.